Okay, so I wasn't gonna spit my feelings out there. Not today. I, I just, if I could get on here or even feel well enough to get up to the bay and to get on here, just to sing and get my tech issues and headset issues and phone issues and hotspot issues all together just to sing. I, I just, that's all I wanted me to do because you know, I've already been very, you know, pretty authentic, uh, transparent. I might have left some things out here and there, but my, my gosh, I mean, you can't ask much more of me than what I've already given anybody. I've shown you, of course, to be a human, the best to be a human. I, I think I've pretty much summed it all up in one complete package here. I've shown you falling apart. I've been honest. I've been candid. I've been, I mean, I, I've given more than many of you as far as being authentic goes. Because many of you aren't even true to yourself or even honest with yourself. So how can you be? That's the world. That said, I, I wasn't going to story today, although I did initially have it on my mind when I woke up. I, once again, I had so much I was passionate about. That's really where my passion lays, despite what I'm going through, is to share with you guys. Even if it's my horror stories of afflictions or traumas in life, you know, there's also stories of victories and overcoming those obstacles all that. And I tried to share the good, the bad, and the ugly with you all, and anybody that's followed me for some time or truly even listened to anything I ever said, you know that. I've shared with you, huh, you know, I'm just like you. And, and Bacon, I, I still, you know, yeah, you've got them jokes. I love them. Keep them rolling. When I get serious or I let it get too serious and I get too sad, Keep them jokes running. I need that. I need that constant. Somebody push me, somebody to make me smile too. I need that encouragement support. Just because I may seem so confident, so strong. Because I am. And I'm courageous. Even I suffer small insecurities or minute, you know, things. Even I still need uplift. Even I still need somebody to remind me that it's okay. Um, that said, uh, I just wanted to share, and I know I've said this before, and it goes along with my thoughts today and what I wanted to share with you all. I told you all about me and the Bible. And I, I was a bookworm, guys. That's the sad thing. I was a bookworm. But this was something I was born into, and that traditionally... So I went to church. I was happy about it. I, I mean, I didn't complain. And I tried, but it just never felt it like in my heart. I mean, hell, I tried to sit down again today. Guys, I, I, I should have had it laid out to show you. It's over here on the bar, and my bar's a mess. I really don't want to show you guys or upset my dog because he's been a butt today. But, guys, I tried. I even tried to organize my thoughts, but once again, so many distractions. You know, I've already shared with you, I'm ADD, I've already suffered memory loss, and, you know, I've already got my illnesses and my disability. I've got enough to contend with. But I was trying to lay it out and get organized for you guys today. But honestly, you know, it's up to you to research your own truth and to figure it out for yourself. And I guess that's maybe perhaps the fun and all that. And I kind of, be like, spoiler alert, if I told you everything, I think ultimately maybe, you know, maybe that's why I'm going through all these tech issues. Maybe that's why I can't get it as organized as I'd like. Maybe that's why I can't maintain a steady stream of thought. Maybe I'm not meant to. Maybe I'm just trying, you know, supposed to give you the gist of it and do the best I can and drop you hints so that you can figure the rest out for yourself. Maybe, maybe that's all of you. But I can tell you this. It's all about love, guys. Uh, oh, that's why I picked up on even leaving this. Uh, somebody recently uh, asked me to call them 
and although I, I generally won't, I, I worked really hard at being an introvert, guys. I, I've explained all the reasons why <laughs> before. Um, worked really hard at it, for one. Um, and a lot of people use sites for dating apps, and I'm not, I'm not trying to just call, you know, Sorry, I, if I want it to be something really, you know, meaningful or something I'm passionate about, somebody that's actually followed, not, hey, you want to, you know, show me your boobs, or you want to, you know, guys just, I'm sorry, a lot of you guys get really stupid, okay, and I'm not that girl, so, um, I'm dealing with enough, I've got health issues, I'm passionate about a lot of things, and if you're not like-minded or passionate about the things I'm passionate about, I'm going to pay you no mind. I will tune you out. So, um, with that said, though, uh, somebody else that's going through, uh, you know, some of the similar health afflictions that I'm going through have reached out to me, and we, we talked for quite some time, and I, I was telling her my approach on positivity, being, being happy, being positive, and that, and, and you can see it was working for me. Any of you who's anybody can look back, not on, I, I, I've always, ever since video arrived here, I've been pretty candid. Um, yeah, I had moments of falling apart, but if you, if you checked out most Morgan's victims, most of them are finding it really hard to stay together, I promise you, on a daily basis, especially somebody who has nobody to be supportive for them. Especially on an everyday basis, like me. He's still trying to remain strong and put a smile on everybody else's face. So, <laughs> just ask. And so, I was saying, you know, as, as long as I applied the positive happy feelings and did the best I could despite what was going on around me, and I sang and tried to be happy and shut out rude people and just try to bless, love them, forgive them, and send them back in. I, I mean, heck, guys, you can see. Not only did my weight fluctuate, I started to look better. I, I thinned out. I, oh, God, don't even start it. I can't even believe I just said that word. I watched the thinning earlier, and that's a whole other subject in itself. <laughs> horrible movie, horrible movie, horrible movie. Have you seen the thinning? But anyway, uh, you know, I started thinning out. I got happier, despite the more gallons and the illnesses. Yes, a lot of times I still feel like crap. But me being positive and applying positivity instead of negativity in my life was benefiting me. Couldn't afford to do much else for myself. So I'm going to the only thing that I know that might work. That led me to letting go and letting God create a source, which for me that's... I now, you know, believe in universal laws and laws of attraction. I'm not scared to mention what I believe anymore because that's what's working for me. Until my child came and stressed me out, until we lost a family dog. I mean, my God, he's been a part of our life, what, eight, I don't know, eight, nine years now, something like that. Anybody be struggling on top of everything I was already going through, anybody would. So I fell apart for a minute. But I just want to let you guys know, I'm okay for one. I, I will be okay. I, I will get through, I will manage the best I, I am capable of. You guys, please reach out to each other. Be a support and upliftment to each other. I try so hard, despite what I'm going through to do it for others. It, it all starts with an act of kindness, paying it forward, doing a good deed and finding it in your heart to love another. That's really what the Bible's getting at, guys about love. Love your neighbor. Love your brother and sister. Forgive their mistakes. Unconditionally love them. As humans, we put so many conditions on things, guys. Especially love. And I'm sure your heart's been broke just like mine has. But guys, it's time to let the healing of planet Earth begin and the healing of humanity begin. And it all starts here. And it starts within. It starts with me. It starts with you. We are who we've been waiting for. We are the change we've been waiting on. It all starts with one simple act of kindness, a smile, even perhaps. So I'm going to give mine to you now. Pass it along, please.